Welcome to Lubot Electronics. Today we'll be having a look at the AX4 CNC pen plotter or drawboard uh, machine. Firstly, I will do a personal, uh, as unbiased as possible, review that I can on the system, and then afterwards I will uh, demonstrate the setup and software procedures involved. So, to get to the point, if you're interested in buying this and you're wondering should you buy it or shouldn't you buy it, what are the key factors that will affect your affect your choice? So first of all, the quality of a of a print are really good. It's really actually defined. Okay, I, I call it a print, but it's really a plot. Or uh, but the quality is essentially defined by your the the pen that you're using. Um, so that is that's a defining quality. Yes, there is a minimum step size, but um, you, you will find uh, that the quality is fairly good. It is able to handle a wide variety of materials um, as long as it is in a pen shape and it can use gravity and capillary action, uh, then it would be able to um, be used with this machine. So that is a big plus point and you can use pretty much any, any sort of pen that you can think of um, on this machine. A big benefit of this machine is you can place it directly on the work area itself and um, so you know if you do have a large area that you need to cover you're not restricted so much by size. Um, okay it is a manual process to move a CNC machine but it's just pointed out that this can fit onto uh, a large piece of uh, material. The setup of this uh, machine is really really quick. Um, it's really nice that they use uh, essentially prefabricated boards um, so that you cannot misalign um, anything. It's really really hard to, to mess up uh, the setup. Where with some of the other machines you actually have to measure it uh, yourself and make sure the alignment is actually perfectly correct and water passes. So, so with this kind of takes care of all of that. Um, it's really really nice and simple to, to set up. It takes about let's say about maybe if if we have to set it up again maybe it would take about maybe an hour or two hours but let's say the first time you set it up um, using the documentation available um, it would take you about uh, maybe three or four hours uh, 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 roughly about. Another nice thing about this uh, machine is that even though it started off as an Arduino based system, we've modified it so that it's all uh, all in one uh, um, controller and it just uses your standard um, uh, stepper motor controllers that, that are easily replaceable um, in case something burns out. And usually with CNC machines, uh, the, f the thing that will break and burn out is usually your motor controller. And also, if you want higher accuracy, you can uh, improve on getting a better motor controller switch scenery. So this machine is upgradable in that sense um, and really really a nice nice to have feature. Although I haven't tested this myself, the, la uh, the, the documentation does show that a laser can be used um, and we, we will probably be finding out more about laser usage on this and what the capabilities are on that. But it is possible to attach third, uh, third party peripherals to it. It's, um, it's just, it doesn't have a lot of wattage to control that motor. So if it is a laser, it would be a fairly small, small laser. It has a fairly large uh, operating area. Um, okay, the documentation states that it is roughly about 20, 20 centimeters by 30 centimeters. Um, and that is fairly correct. Okay, at the end you will you will probably run into problems. I would probably say give or take, you know, about 10 millimeters from that. Um, but it has a fairly large um, air build area, which is really nice and not expected from such a small uh, small machine. 
there are no heavy components on the the second axis that's moving um, so it's able to move really fast um, and it's really lightweight and it's compact and it is really nicely centered now the negative side to that is is if you apply okay it all uh, it, if you apply too much weight on the one side you can easily imbalance the system as well okay it does have sturdy sturdy standings but it is worth noting that you can't add too much weight okay one one extra negative point that you could say is a negative point is just the system is completely driven by gravity or you're restricted to gravity and your pen that you're choosing so if your pen is too light it will take uh, a, a longer time for it to drop down and touch a surface area and if your pen is heavy um, it will it will be quicker but now also it doesn't apply any force to the let's say if you're drawing to a piece of paper it doesn't apply any force onto that paper so it's completely driven by gravity so if your pen is not heavy enough and it doesn't have uh, it doesn't use uh, capital reaction then you you know you will have a hard time using it when it comes to using the software it's really straightforward you have one or two options essentially um, you can either use light fire which is the older um, uh, older version of software open source software that interacts with uh, CNC machines or the, uh, a newer and more updated package would be laser GBRL so what I'm showing you here is light fire um, it is not as capable but it is still definitely usable Then your second option here is to use laser GBRL and that is a very comprehensive package and allows you to do quite a lot of um, options and modifications and settings to how your drawing will come out. So um, and it is a very nice package and easy to use as well. So. A neat little trick with this machine is that you can separate your images into two separate images um, or multiple images each for a different color so if you need different colors or different materials being deposited by the, uh, the pen um, then this is a nice way to separate it out as well so that's the end of this video and the demonstration. I hope you will uh, make an informed decision whether or not to purchase this and whether it would be suitable for your needs. And so I greet you until the next video.